Hey guys, time for another Youth Video Report Tuesday. <laughs> Hey guys, hope everybody's having a great Tuesday. Got a big announcement. You probably already heard this Sunday, we will start back having church. It's only Sunday morning worship, it starts at 1030. No, we will not have youth class or the children or the jam or the nurse or anything like that. But hey, it's something. We haven't been able to meet uh, since like the middle of March. So anyway, this Sunday, 1030, be there. There'll be all kinds of information this week talking about what you can expect about uh, the social distancing and the rows that will be. Every other row will probably be marked off so that we can keep ourselves uh, separate as best we can. But anyway, great news. We'll start back this Sunday. I hope that you'll be there. I would love to see all of you there. Anyway, guys, having said that, I want to read a verse of scripture to you from Hebrews chapter 10. Hebrews chapter 10, uh, verses 23 through 25. And it says this, let us hold fast the confession of our hope without wavering, for he who promised is faithful. And let us consider one another in order to stir up love and good works, not forsaking the assembly of ourselves together, as is the manner of some, but exhorting one another, and so much the more as you see the day approaching. Now, in this passage, we use this passage a lot of times, especially the, the latter part of verse 25, to remind folks why it's important that we don't forsake the assembly of, of, to get, of coming together, which means that we don't not come to church or we don't stay at home when we ought to be uh, faithful in attendance. Why do we go to church? Is it just so we can check a box and say, hey, I went to church, hey? No, the reason we come to church is for a lot of different reasons, but one is the fellowship. We haven't been able to fellowship one another at all. Fellowship will be kind of limited because of the social distancing, but we'll all get to come and be together. We'll get to actually look and see, you know, uh, Brother Milan up there preaching instead of just having to watch it on the video. I understand there will still be a video. I'm not sure if it's going to be on YouTube and everything like that, like it has been. I think it will. Uh, but better in person, right? Uh, the other reason is the building, uh, equipping the saints, as, as, as the Word of God likes to say, to help us learn. Uh, the more we're under the hearing of the Word of God, the more that stays in our head. The more those things stay in our head, the less the world tries to crowd in and, and get in our head with all the negativity and all the other things that we are just constantly bombarded with all over the place. So anyway, guys, this is short. I can't wait to see all of you there. I hope that, uh, you know, we'll do, I'm just doing fist pumps, okay, or bumps, whatever, um, or elbows or, or whatever. We won't, I won't be doing any hugging or anything like that. Um, we can do, you know, virtual hugs, just, you know, whatever. But anyway, it'd just be great to see everybody. I can't wait. Hope to see you there. Have a great day today. We'll talk more about this as we go through the week. Have a good day. God bless you. Bye. <laughs>